Coming in contact with electricity can have a number of major health effects. It depends on a number of things. What part of your body that electricity goes through, the voltage of the electricity, and even more importantly, the current of the electricity. So if it's just a, uh, a piece of equipment that is not plugged into the mains, well, it, it's, it's probably only 12 volt or 24 volt, doesn't have that same voltage as the 240 volts that you get out of your wall socket. Remember that voltage is that potential energy, so it's, um, it's got a lot more push behind it. Okay, so it depends on what part of your body gets in contact. Uh, but essentially, electricity wants to go, if you become in contact with electricity, for example, you're touching an electrical wire that uh, is exposed. So for example, there might be a damaged piece of wiring or, or you know, you might, you might be putting um, you know, your, your fork or your knife in, into the toaster. Or it might be that there's a fault and then there's a wire touching the metal casing of the piece of equipment. And for whatever reason, there's, uh, your body is in contact with that electri electricity. So you're touching the electricity with your hand, say for example, and what that electricity is going to do is it's going to run through your body down to the earth because electricity has a tendency to want to run there into the earth and it'll take the shortest path. Now, the human body is actually a very good insulator inside because we've got lots of water that's got um, salt in it and it's an electrolyte and it's a very good conductor. So the electricity is going to want to go through your body very, very quickly. So if that electricity goes through your heart, well, it can actually cause uh, electrical uh, disruption of the heart because the, the, our hearts are regulated by an internal electrical signal or uh, that is generated by the heart, or the pacemaker of our heart, and that tells our heart when to beat. Now, if you pass a whole heap of electricity through it, it's gonna disrupt that and it's going to put the heart into a cardiac arrest. It's gonna make the heart um, contract violently and or, or stop. It's gonna disrupt that electrical activity of the heart. So look, passing electricity through the heart can actually stop the heart from beating or it can cause arrhythmias and it can be very, very serious. As well as that, where the electricity is in contact with the body, whether it's the hand or any other part of your body, and also where that electricity exits the body, you can have really quite severe burns uh, because uh, <coughs> the, the skin is actually a resistor so if you resist the flow of electricity you actually increase heat so it gets very very hot you can have burns internally as well another thing that can happen is that if you hold on to an electrical wire it makes your muscles contract uncontrollably and you cannot let go of the electrical wire which of course is very damaging in itself in that you're getting electrical burns yeah uh, maybe it's going through your heart as well. But as well as that, it's a violent contraction of the muscles and you can cause muscle damage, but you can also cause bone damage. You can pull a muscle off the bone. You can cause a fracture of a bone. So electricity can be very, very damaging to the body.